Pro um, C459 Probate Court 4-D Judge J. Anderson. Yeah, this is Rainbow G Works, Titus chapter 2, verse 14. Zealous of good works, eager to doing what is good. G Works is a business that represents and therefore go, reach eternal life, reach eternal life through Christ, and keep the cross moving. Um, G Works also represents CMC, cross movement clues, trying to figure out clues within the Bible. Um, there goes a clue. Um, there goes a clue. The cross is a clue that Jesus Christ died on the cross for the sins of the world. I'm now here at the government center. Um, I have a court date with Daniel Wexler. Um, he is, he is my, um, he is my, um, um, attorney. Um, and, um, he's going to be fighting for me today. I don't have a lot of money again to pay for a lawyer. I mean, um, Dan, Dan, Daniel Wexler is like a lawyer. Um, yeah, um, he's he's gonna be fighting for for me, and I don't have a lot of money to pay for a lawyer. So he's a paid uh, paid lawyer that's gonna be fighting for me today. Um, and um, um, what I'm gonna be going to court here today is um, for them to be um, uh, making some judgments to see if I'm mentally ill, see if I need to be recommitted. I've been on the commitment for about five years now. It's going on six six years. It's going on a six year where I've been committed, and I've been um, I've been um, I've been committed. I've been on a commitment for about six six years now. So um, um, I'm going to um, I'm going to. Um, the things that they're trying to commit me for is um, me if I'm anti-psychotic medic, do I need anti-psychotic medications for me to not be crazy or psychotic within the community? Which I don't think that I'm psychotic or I don't think I don't think that I'm crazy. But um, I I really do think that I need these medications because of the fall of human beings and their sinful nature. In the way how human <coughs> beings, um, their 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 character defects within their nature. Right. Um, the human being has just got um, a certain character defects with, but within him that is um, sinful, as um, the scripture says, when Adam sinned, sin entered their entire human race. Adam sin brought death, so death spread to everyone. For everyone sin. So like so um, so everybody has this because of this fallen nature because of this fallen nature of of of, of human beings, everybody has some like um, this character this, this character defect about them, Ooh, meaning this of time of this of sinful nature the sinful stuff. nature that is just sinful. Yeah. Modern technology has gotten us far, but the so, respiratory so, that they're trying to prescribe for him is just not right. Yeah, so they, this is not the best best option for him. I, I recommend I, Depakote. He does not want to be committed to on the Respiradol, but the Depakote is necessary. If, yeah. Because he's asked several times, if I'm not sure, how many times have you asked? Several times. I'm not, I'm not clear. How many times have you asked? Like, I've been all asked, the time. I've asked a lot of times. Sporadically. And, yeah. and, and how can they deny a, someone who has a mental health issue Medications that doesn't make sense right. at all, and I know that that can transpire because it's happened to me. I've been waiting four months for a uh, four to six months, if I'm not sure, it's one to six months. So for so, screening. So so you take I mean, four you, different diagnoses. You take antipsychotic medication. You take antipsychotic I take, medications. I take mood stabilizers. I take yes. antipsychotics. They just have me uh, court committed for antipsychotics, which are not good for it. I've been off of them before. I lived great. Accident. Antipsychotics. Yeah. Doesn't make sense. No questions. Yeah. No serious questions. No nothing. And that's not a that's not a a, a, a a parole thing. It should be registered in that manner. If you ask me, yeah. you know, if you, if something happens, you should be asked questions. Well, you know, files should be kept and everything. 
but it's it's not in that manner, and you can't really trust the written up things about the certain patient or the the respondent or the, the this particular name for for him in this case, because they're not a hundred percent true. And sometimes, you know, I can't say doctors get tired, but they get f fancy. But you know, but and I, I, and, and they get they can get sick of you. Word. Yeah, but I, I want to say sick of I want to say something. I do need the antipsychotic medications, and I think that the United States of America, most citizens and Americans need antipsychotic medications. No. But but nobody who is an antipsychotic. <laughs> what about your, what about your kidneys? What about your health? But what about your eyesight? Nobody needs you? nobody <clears throat> needs to be forced to take anti anti psychotic medication when they don't need they don't need to be forced to take it right and, and that's what this video is all about right don't don't force this upon people and, if and, they don't want to take and, it and, and, and mothers fathers because I've seen this so many times mothers and fathers have arguments and they, they send their children to the hospital don't do that don't do that that's not the best route maybe I can't tell the parents to take a breather but send them to their aunts and uncles or something do what it is that they want them to do that they want you to do for them say I love you I can cut my shoes for a little while <laughs> you know it, that's pretty much what it is. You don't want to, you know, m move your shoes in the mind. Just go to your uncles and aunts, you know, lighten up on them, you know. Jeez. Because, you know, because most people put them in, in, uh, in hospitals, and then when they go there, they're not known, and they're asked questions that they don't, they don't entrust these people. The average teenager, adult, don't, don't trust an, an individual that's not a family peer or a, a respected uh, teacher or something like that, and they, and they, and they're in a vulnerable situation at the time. And they don't want to ask que answer questions because they don't know if they're going to do this to them, do that to them. They've heard things. They've seen things. This dude, he's on medication, you know, you know, take it to heart. And, you know, it's, it's really, it's, it, it does a job. It does a job because in my situation, waiting one to six months, uh, I, I really pretty much went through. I, I just got out of treatment uh, about three or four days ago. I've been up for three days. I've been up for three days. Because I, I lost my apartment because of it. Uh, I've been up for about three days. But uh, it's, it's been cool because I've been trying to handle this uh, antacid problem. I mean, I'm, I'm, going to, uh, I'm going to court on, on another level. Uh, but, uh, <laughs> so, it's, it's, and I don't have proper representation. That's another thing for us people with mental health. If there were attorneys who could help us, you know, uh, not pro bono, but if there were some government funds put up for people with mental health, they would see a, a, a vast improvement in this in this state because they would be represented properly by a strong firm or strong, you know, because we can't really trust too many. But money talks and, and efforts talk. Good people talk. But in, in some situations, when you have an attorney, they don't talk, and, the, and the, the, the defender is always grilling at you. He grills at you. I remember one time the defendant was <clears throat> getting so, he was getting, uh, what, Aaron Brockovich. He was getting Aaron Brockovich uh, about uh, about 400 milligrams, not even milligrams, but an antipsychotic or something like that. Really didn't matter to me. I was young. But, uh, and, and the judge was literally shaking, shaking, you know, and he was feeling my anger too. And I was hoping he was creative, you know. Yeah, so um, this is Ray with G Works representing yeah, the cross and keeping the cross moving, hey, and um, and just saying, and um, just saying that um, it's got a got a lot of documentations right here, a lot of doc documentations right here of me gotten to go to court court today, and um, people got a mental illness, you know. As you say, said, my friend right here, he's got a mental illness, and um, people oh, do. Yeah. People got a mental illness. I I'll got a mental. I got a mental. Illness. I got a mental illness, I do not, and I do need. Not. I need the Word of God, the the Bible, to help me with the mental illness. I'll tell you this. This is right what G Works representing hey, the cross thing, one more point. and keeping the cross moving. I'm out. One more point. One more point. <laughs>